Good afternoon. Today is Tuesday, March 12, 2019. I'm Ethan Wolf Stelsner. The first person to go to Mars will likely be a woman, and we've got details. And I'm Jim. And one of the next visitors to the moon will be a woman as well. The news is next. Do you play Super Smash Brothers? The Nampa Esports Club is hosting a Super Smash Brothers tournament in the cafeteria after school this Friday. Entry is $5 and the prize for the top three places is gift cards to GameStop. Everyone is welcome to come and watch and find out more about the Esports Club. Nampa High Theater will be presenting The Rainmaker Wednesday through Saturday, March 13th to 16th in the Little Theater. The show starts at 7 p.m. each evening and the tickets are $6 for adults, $5 for students, or $4 with an ASB card. You can purchase tickets online at tntdrama.ludus.com. Get them now before we sell out. Plan to attend a night of food, fun, and the arts on, Tuesday next, on next Tuesday, March 19th from 5.30 to 7 p.m. in the Napa High School cafeteria. There will be ceramic bowls that are handmade by NHS Pottery students and art club members. Bowls are available through donation or silent auction with all proceedings going to benefit Catch. Catch is a nonprofit organization committed to rehousing and service home in homeless families within our community. Today's activities, Boys Golf Invitational at Centennial Golf Course, Softball at Weezer at 5. We'll be back after this. Spotlight Theater and Columbia Performing Arts presents West Side Story at the Columbia Performing Arts Center, 301 South Happy Valley Road, Nampa, March 7th through 9th and 14th through 16th. At 7 p.m., tickets available at tickleap.com. What's your role? I'm Riff. I play Doc. I'm playing Maria. I'm also playing Maria. I'm playing Anita. I'm also playing Anita. I play the role of Bernardo. So come and see them. They have been working so hard. Today's weather is brought to you by Dr. Kim Keller. Your smile is your first impression. Make yours a great one and see Dr. Keller today. So for today's weather, we have a high of 46 and a low of 29. And tomorrow we'll have a high of 47 and a low of 24. Back to you, Drew. The chances are the first person to land on the red planet will be a woman, the head of NASA said recently. Jim Bridenstine was a guest on the science and technology radio show, Science Friday, when he teased that a woman is likely to be the first person on Mars. The NASA administrator did not identify a specific person, but said women are at the forefront of the agency's upcoming plans. Bridenstine responded absolutely to a question from a Twitter user who asked whether women will be included in the agency's next trip to the moon. SpaceX's Crew Dragon capsule cruised into port at Cape Canaveral Saturday night. Onlookers gathered at Jetty Park, a popular launch viewing location at the mouth of the port, in anticipation of Dragon's arrival. SpaceX's Go Searcher recovery ship pulled into port just after 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Saturday's arrival wrapped up a successful uncrewed demonstration mission for Crew Dragon that began one week prior. A Falcon 9 rocket lofted the capsule into orbit on March 2nd from a historic pad 39A at NASA's Kennedy Space Center. The SAT word of the day is annex, which means to add or attach. You could use it like this. Although the subdivision fought the city council, they were annexed into the city. That's the news. Thanks for watching. And remember, live, live the, the bulldog, bulldog way. way.